Alzheimer's disease is a significant public health challenge. Currently, there are almost 6 million Americans living with Alzheimer's disease, and that number is expected to more than double in the next 30 years. So about 70 plus percent of cases of dementia overall um, are Alzheimer's disease cases. And generally what we think about in Alzheimer's disease, we think about people who are losing their memory capabilities and other cognitive functions. And then over time that those capabilities will continue to deteriorate. And we now know the pathology behind Alzheimer's disease, but what we're trying to do is figure out how do we treat, potentially cure, or at least stop, and then we clearly want to be able to prevent it. It's critical that we identify strategies by which we can prevent Alzheimer's disease or at a minimum slow its development. One such strategy appears to be diet. There is evidence that healthy diet patterns, particularly healthy plant-based diet patterns such as the Mediterranean diet, are associated with a lower risk of Alzheimer's disease. One important component of these types of plant-based diets are plant metabolites called flavonoids. And these flavonoids have both antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. There is evidence from short-term intervention studies that flavonoids may help improve cognitive performance. However, there is limited evidence that flavonoids can prevent Alzheimer's disease or slow age-related cognitive decline. To address this knowledge gap, Dr. Jakes and Dr. O assembled a team to research the relationship between flavonoid intake and cognitive function. What we were able to show as part of that study is that those individuals who had the highest intakes of three types of flavonoids had a greater than 50% reduction in risk of Alzheimer's disease compared to those with the lowest intakes of those same flavonoids. This research is important for two reasons. First of all, the findings help us to better understand what components of these healthy plant-based diets may be associated with preserving cognitive health. And second, it again demonstrates the importance of a healthy diet in preventing Alzheimer's disease. That dementia is actually, and particularly Alzheimer's disease, is something that appears later in life. And in fact, what we've learned is that dementia is actually a life course disease. And it's what you do earlier in life that impacts your risk later in life. And one of the great things about looking at dietary risk factors is those are modifiable. So it's not that you're on some sort of inevitable course that's being dictated by your genetic framework that says that, well, you're definitely going to end up with dementia. You're definitely going to end up with a diagnosis of Alzheimer's disease. It actually puts the control in your hand because you can do something about your diet. 